Welcome to a very special edition of The Vault. This is a Devil's Night Vault. We're going to be looking at some coins as normal. My name's Tripwire. And today's actually a very special show. Um, what we have is I got a package from Mayor Videos. He says he's going to send me over some pennies. Thank you so much, dude. You guys get a chance to check out his channel. I'm going to put a link down below so y'all just click it and watch it. Trust me, it's like really, really cool. But anyhow, Devil's Night, for those of you that do not know, um, it's not in every state in Michigan or in the United States. But I know we have it in Michigan, but it's not as popular anymore. Devil's Night always falls on the 30th of October. And basically, you just go out and destroy crap. <laughs> I don't know. You just play, play pranks on people, soap windows. And some people take it too far. If you've ever seen the movie, I, I want to say it's The Crow. I believe it is The Crow. Uh, they do a good representation of what Devil's Night is because over in Detroit, they just burn houses down. Or at least they used to. It hasn't gotten that bad. But fear not. Fear not about the Devil's Night due to the fact that I went through some pocket change earlier that Chemical X gave me. I found one of those angel tokens. It's an angel token. <laughs> so we are safe from the devils. Well, I'm not. You guys are. <laughs> Anyhow, thank you so much, Mayor. We're going to check this out right now. First, we need a beverage. And yes, I am on. I am in Hale, Michigan today. I was out metal detecting with size detecting. Um, over a day, so it was like really cool. We had a blast. You'll see those videos tomorrow. It's a, we did a huge series, huge. But anyhow, today we are drinking, okay, Stewart's Root Beer. Um, to be honest, I may have done this one already. It sounds like really familiar, but over here it's hard to find anything original, super original. But I'm going to shove so we can do some drinking. Well, they perfected the art of foam. They got the foam good on this one. <laughs> Anyhow, it's really good, so I like this one. So I'm going to shut up, so that way we can start looking at Maynard's pennies. All right, I don't know what it is with us metalheads, but anytime we go to wrap something, it takes forever to try to open it, because we seal the crap out of everything. <laughs> Glad I had a knife, or otherwise we wouldn't be doing Maynard's coins. Dude, if, I'm a, if I am destroying your uh, name, please let me know. I don't want to get the bad name or anything. Videos. <laughs> Smiley face with the videos. Mayor's, I'm t <laughs> you know what? This has got to be the coolest calling card I ever seen. <laughs> this is a total business card and a half. <laughs> Dude, this rolls. <laughs> this is going everywhere. I'm putting this on both Facebook pages. I'll mail this out to friends. I don't Dude, that is awesome. <laughs> oh, I'm just like, I got I to gotta get the nuts back out. <laughs> Thanks, Mayor. Oh, that, that's awesome. I went, to, I went to go open this, so I flipped it over, and apparently there's another message. <laughs> Happy hunting, DW. Dude, this is awesome, I swear. I don't even want to open it. That's it. The vault's over. I'm keeping this just the way it is. <laughs> okay, I got to get this show on the road. I'm laughing too much. That's awesome, dude. Thank you so much. That's cool. <laughs> okay, we got three killer rolls to go over here. Um, I'm going to open up this one first. That was too awesome, dude. That's all I gotta say. That was beyond awesome. Yeah, uh, I'm just I'm over here. I was over. I'm over here once a year over in uh, the little city I'm in. Okay, go out. Oh, oh crap! Right off the bat, dude. Straight off the bat. Boom. Okay, I can see when that problems. Boom. Check that out. Uh, one second, please. Okay. Um, again, I gotta do this standing up so that the camera may wobble a little bit. But bam! Right off the bat, my favorite penny, uh, two thousand and nine, because they do for for these pennies, and they tell a story of Abraham Lincoln's life. America is capable of making cool coins. Let's get back on that, please. Yeah, that's actually one of my favorite. That's it. That is my favorite. Copper. I'm do this standing up again. Whoop. And I feel like I'm right at home because the lighting here sucks too. 67. Awesome. That's an upside down thing. Turn around, buddy. Ooh, 74. Looks like we're going to have a lot of copper, it looks like. Hard for me to tell. I don't take that one. Yeah, I love doing this. I got brown on a dark surface. That really helps out a lot. 69. Cool. If this was the... Cyber detecting game. I got a great joke about that. 69. And I'm not saying it. I'm not saying it. Keep it. Keep it. Keep it G. Keep it G. TW. Keep it G. 92. Actually. 
No. Okay. I thought for a minute that might be a rainbow coin. 75. I have no idea. <laughs> now, this actually looks like a pretty decent rainbow coin. Hmm. I'm going to have to put that in the rainbow collection. Thank you all very much for supporting Straight Up Metal Detecting. If you guys got any suggestions on anything we should do over here, just leave a comment below. I'm willing to try anything. My channel is your channel. Keep that in mind. Ooh, 75. 2,000, yep. 70, yep. 62. Boom. 68. You're making me rich, man. You're making me rich. Retirement fund. I don't know if it's, I know, uh, you're, I know Maynard's in Canada. And uh, I think the very first show I did was about hoarding copper pennies. Because we can't melt them here in America. But I'm not even exactly 100% sure if we could take the American pennies over to Canada so they can melt it. But, didn't look that deep into it. What do you guys do with your pennies? Uh, I know the bank still takes them, because I was talking with size detecting about, we brought up the Canadian pennies. He, he told me that the bank takes them, but they don't release them back into the public. And I know you guys, over in Canada, have a heck of a lot more copper dates than we do. I think you guys, ooh, rainbow? I'll call it rainbow. Um, 77. I know I was talking about something, and I swear I just totally forgot. Yeah, do you guys melt yours? I'm not sure how you guys do that. Are you allowed to melt and get your profit? Bizarre question, I must know. If you, if, if you know, throw it in the comments below. I would love to pass on some uh, Canadian penny information to everybody. Especially when it comes to making a profit. Yeah, I think if you go back to the very first vault coin collecting show, I believe that the topic was copper pennies and why you should hoard them. Well, that's being a little forceful there. I'm not saying you should, but I do. That's a good idea. When in doubt, if you guys don't believe me, go check it out on uh, Facebook, uh, YouTube. That's where I got a lot of my information from. Okay, there's roll number one. It's about half and half on the copper. <laughs> Awesomeness. Hey. That looks interesting. Dude, I, I just made a profit on this one. <laughs> oh, dude. Sorry, I, I, I'm opening up the roll. I'm making sure I didn't get anything. Look what I see. Look what I see. You guys are going to have to wait and see. But I'm not showing it right away. I saw it. I saw it. Yes, dude. You rule me. That's all I got to say. Boom, boom, boom. Again, I'll be dropping a link to his channel. Do me a favor. Do yourself a favor. How about that? Do yourself a favor and go check out his videos. 72. That is... You guys put it in camera folks. Hold on. Wait! Yes, dude. Awesomeness. Absolute 100% awesomeness. I have no idea. I love wheat pennies. I don't know why. I don't like them as much as the 2000. Well, I do, I, but I like the 2009 for the art design. Speaking of art design, you know who has crazy, crazy artistic coins? Canada. They come up with some really cool stuff. It was actually interesting. Way back when I first started coin collecting, Chemical X wanted to do it with me. And he noticed that there was a lot of animals on the Canadian coins. And he's an animal fanatic. I think that's seven. So he started collecting all the uh, Canadian coins. Still got them somewhere. But he got out of it as fast as he got in it because, hey, coin collecting is not for everybody. It's a dying art. It's a dying art. So far, we're doing pretty good on time. Too bad my back is screaming at me. Saying, Stop, you fool. Don't stand. Why is it every single time... I go on location. I always gotta stand and do this. Probably because I'm using a table. Now I know why I sit on the floor. <laughs> it's just easier that way. But I always sit on the floor. Nope. Oh, yeah, that'll help. 
Not what. <laughs> Uh, yeah, um, we're getting really, really close to uh, charity month. I will be releasing a video Sunday on that because I got a massive and it just got bigger giveaway. Just got a lot, lot bigger and I wasn't expecting it. So, yeah, I was going to have to check this out. I hate giving out information before I do anything because I like to make stuff surprise. Keeps the show interesting. Bait and hook. <laughs> yeah, that's a good idea. Jump in those mosh pits. Do those stage dives. Get thrown to the concrete ground while wrestling. Yeah, good idea. Just growing up, I wanted to be evil Knievel. So I did everything that he possibly did with a bike. I could tell you stories. But once again, especially the worst injury. It's a family show. Can't talk about that. Last roll. We might have time for a search for silver. Yeah, we got some silver going. Oh, we got some uh, quarters. Come on, we need some quarters. Oh, wait. Oh, oh, I'll save it to the very end of the penny. I can see it. Where is that? Oh, come here. Get out. I want every single one of you. Thank you. Okay, this I'm just keeping because it's cool. I know the lighting here sucks big time, but you can see the whole... Uh, zinc, uh, border, uh, edge, rim, the whole zinc rim is gone, or the copper on the zinc is gone, so I'm keeping that one just for my own self, because I like it. I'm beginning to wonder, do you guys find as many, over in Canada, do you guys find as many American pennies as we find Canadian? i seen that, I got tons of Canadian. Again, your copper ends at like... 92, ni no, 1994 is when uh, Canada switched over. So you're pretty knowledgeable about Canadian coins, especially being from America. Yeah, get back here. Can't see you. Can't see you. Can't count you. Oh, nice shiny, but we don't need that one. 91. Nope. Put <laughs> been putting together massive videos. And I'm one of those people where if I sh if I film it, I usually release it. And with as much film that we got for tomorrow's show on Halloween, I'm gonna have to cut it four times. So it's gonna be in four different parts, maybe five. That's how much footage we got. I did have to edit one thing out. Someone did not want to be on camera, and I accidentally got my camera. I said, dude, trust me, I am not going to put you on camera. I will edit this whole thing if I have to. I'll tell you more about the hunt, but you're just going to have to wait along with everything else. Let me know if you guys find something that's like really super cool. If you're uh, doing coins, let me know. Send me a picture. I'll be more than happy. To... Actually, I'll be ecstatic to throw it into this vault. What was it the only one day I got so far? I think it was Mama's Gone Detective. She sent me a, a picture of uh, the coronavirus coin, which I display ever so proudly in my room. I love the acoustics in this room. It's just like, you hear everything echoing off the wall. Got a television that is so loud. You put it on one, and that's all you need. Normally, I usually crank it up to like 28, 29, 40. But this, this TV is like, jeez, crime. What was that, 64? Yeah, 64. 67? Cool. We have some time to do some other coins. Yeah, yeah. For a minute, I thought it was going to take up the whole show. Which I am not arguing. I've done it before, and I have a blast with it. So, so now you guys know the reason why behind a very special introduction. It's Devil's Night. So, I might as well put in some deicide, and it's D-E-I-C-I-D-E. -E. A lot of people always come to me, deicide? I'm like, no, dia, dia. What does that mean? I'm not going to tell you, dude. <laughs> it's a family show. I love deicide, my favorite black death metal band. And we got a couple more here. Boom. 
And the last one here. So we still got a couple of bonus. Ooh. Ooh. What do we got? 69. Flip. No, I can't really call that a wheat. I mean, I mean a rainbow. Anyhow, we made... Mm, we made that scent. <laughs> you snuck in some dimes on me. <laughs> I feel like I got to mail them back now. Um, you know what? You know what we forgot to do is check the date on this one. 50 something. Totally awesome. And found another wheat penny. Oh, crap. Found another wheat penny. <laughs> that was an epic fail on that one. 19. Was that 41? Or 57? One moment, please. I really must know this. 47D. All right. Sweet. Uh, let's jump into some more coin rolls. I'm going to switch things up a little bit. Let's do a roll of nickels, and then it's going to be search for silver or search for Bob Ross coins. All right, there we go. Let's see what we got in the nickel world. I'm going to pull that up big time. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, nope. It would help if I got it into the camera. It's getting blurry again. I don't know why. Nope, 71. I almost thought that, that was going to be a really good mad coin for a second there. Yeah. Dang it. I did go with the pennies. What happened? Uh, what is that? I can't make out these dates up because of the way it's angled. 77. 2000 something. Nope. See. Nope. I'm still trying to get coins from the stupid bank. I don't know what's going on with that. It's far too long for that. I think there's a TCF around here. Maybe they got some. 79. Nope. Nope. 93. Boom. 2000. Nope. Nope. We're nickel. I lied. Point for Haha. Uh -huh. Got you. Pranks. It's Devil's Night. Huh. There you go. Yeah, Devil's Night for, for a while there was like really bad. Now you hardly ever hear about it. Yes, I did go out on Devil's Night a few times, but I didn't do anything because I respect other people's stuff. I remember one year I, I soaked my own windows just so I had something to do. <laughs> Everyone came in the neighborhood. You got hit on Devil's Night? I'm like, nope. I even found one. I'm like, no, I did it myself. Why? <laughs> mm -hmm. I felt left out. And I left the gasoline in the other car. Can't go burn down houses. Yeah, again, I believe it's the movie Crow. You know what I might do? It has nothing to do with coin collecting. <laughs> but I might look up the history of Devil's Night. How did it start? Why did it start? Nope. So I only got 160 out of it, so are you kidding me? That's it? Nope. Nope. I had to keep my mind on uh, 2009. Sometimes I, I, I space on that. And we have another earthquake with the camera. Nope. Nope. And last one. Boom. Boom. Nope. Ah, that ain't coming at all. All right, let's do some, this will call it for today. We will do some search for silver. Got a bag. Oh, oh, that's interesting. I was not ready for it to be like that. We got quarters here. Some of us got paid in quarters one day. Let's see if we can find anything decent out of here. I don't know if I pulled it up right. Oh. Up, up, up. Thank you. Nope. Oh, 2020. I like those. For some reason I got this stupid habit. <laughs> Michigan. <laughs> there you go. I don't know if it's good or bad, but every time a new year passes, I set those aside and I put them in the display. I put them in the vault. I gotta hand it to you. This one's like super shiny. I don't even know what that 2019? You know what? I don't think I have this one. And this is actually like, God, jeez, Lord. That one's like really, really, 
really good condition. Yep. 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 Bob Ross coin. No. Trick or treat. I'm sorry. Double tonight. Got you again. When was the last time we found a Bob Ross coin? It's been a while. I guess everybody in the world watched a vault and they all went and hoarded <laughs> all the all the Bob Ross coins. No, I don't. Nope. It's a lot louder in here <laughs> than than the vault. It's like a whole ton louder. No. Nope. That's what you see this. Nope. Ninety three, nope. Nope. Oh, okay, here's another one. It's like it's in really nice condition, too. Super shiny. Put that one off this side. I gotta pull something out, right? And I'm not pulling out this one at all. You can't pay me to pull this one out. I love that sound. Yep. Darn it. No. Yeah, I feel it's hard to find silver in pocket change. Nope. Come on, give us something more than just those coins. I'll take a bicentennial at this point. 94. Should be the other way around. I want a 1949. Wrong way. Oklahoma. I'm down to the last few here. My back could not be happier. Stay still. Stay still. Mm -hmm. No. Nope. Three left. Nope. Mm -mm. And no. Oh well. All right, this concludes another edition of The Vault. Once again, thank you so much, Mayor, for the pennies. I didn't think you were going to slip any wheats in, but I, I found them. You're trying to hide them on me. I got you. Anyhow, y'all need to do me a favor. Like, subscribe, keep the hunt alive. And if you're a coin collector, you're never broke. We'll see you again next week. Y'all take care. Later.